lovely morning spent down chilling at the pool and now we're on our way to get a taxi to go to the True Love Cafe which is a cafe full of huskies and I'm so excited I discovered it like a year and a half ago um, and I really wanted to go so we're on it change of plan we got there we got to the husky cafe and it said it was sold out even though we got there half an hour early like they said so instead we've come to the unicorn cafe <laughs> to I think it's called Limpini Park or something like that um, we're just walking there and then we're gonna get a taxi to Chinatown we just went to the unicorn cafe which is very cute I actually forgot to take a video of the food we ate um, but here's a picture of it story time Liv just reminded me um, I never said about the taxi that we got from the airport to our hotel it was terrifying. <laughs> we had no idea what we were doing. I don't know, like this guy, he was just really weird. Very adamant, like, kind of like, get us in the taxi sort of thing. And then he, he like, took us to this random, like... There's an underground bit of that, wasn't it? Like yeah, this underground bit, and we were like, what's going on? And there was this point where we heard the doors, like he locked the doors, and we were like, <gasps> we're gonna kill us, we're gonna die. And then, um, and then he went to fill up petrol, and we were just a bit like, it was wasn't petrol, was it air? So he went to this like petrol station and they put the bonnet up and they, I think they were filling up air and he was talking to this other guy and they were like looking at us in the car and we were like, oh my God, they're actually gonna, they're gonna steal us away. <laughs> everyone, before I came on this trip, everyone was like, don't get stolen. And I sat there like, oh my God, what if I actually get stolen? <laughs> But it was fine. We got there eventually. It took so long. It took us like three hours. He was just a bit weird. We, we had no idea where we were going. Baby doll. Oh, and he had this, this doll in his car and he kept... I think, isn't that like a good luck thing? Isn't that something to do with dolls? I don't know. Anyway, he Fucking kept... Say to me. <laughs> yeah, he kept like fiddling with the feet of this doll and crossing the legs. Like the over and over again. I don't even know. It was very strange and scary because that was literally our first few hours in Thailand. He didn't speak at all either. Yeah, he didn't speak he did at all speak. and it was just very dodgy. But every other taxi and tuk-tuk we've had has been pretty good, hasn't it? It's been safe, they've been really friendly, um, not too expensive. <laughs> 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 of day two it was a very nice day I'm still very sweaty we've just got into our hotel and um, we've just put the aircon on so it's gonna get nice and cold um, we went to Chinatown I mean it wasn't amazing it was I preferred where we went yesterday the Kusan Road um, 
because one it was cheaper like Chinatown was like stupidly expensive for food we got some street food um, we got spring rolls I'm not entirely sure what was in them they were meant to be vegetable spring rolls but I'm not I, I'm not so sure um, it was just a bit I don't know what do you think Liv? crowded and expensive Okay, Sam Road is much better, and I think we ate dog. Oh! <laughs> ate dog. Oh, no. Oh, it was nice. really smelly as well. Like, it, it stank. I don't know whether it was the meat, like, all the meat and the street food, like, um, in the heat. But it was also a mix of, like, sewage. And occasionally you'd walk past, like, a nice shop that sold um, incense, and that would smell nice. But, like, most of it just smelt. Um, so it wasn't great. Like, I personally wouldn't go there again. Um, tomorrow we are finally going to go to the Husky Cafe. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> 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 <laughs>